हेलो एवरीवन एंड वेलकम टू द फैंटेसी मैच प्रीव्यू फॉर द गेम बिटवीन चेन्नई एंड बैंगलोर बिफोर द प्रीव्यू आई एड लाइक टू स्पीक अबाउट द फैन टू प्ले लीडर बोर्ड वेद द टॉप थ्री विनर्स गो टू ऑस्ट्रेलिया टू वॉच द टी ट्वेंटी वर्ल्ड कप एंड द बेस्ट पार्ट दिस लीडर बोर्ड रिफ्रेश फोर टाइम्स ड्यूरिंग द होल आई पी एल करेंटली वे ऑन द सेकेंड फेज सो यू कैन गो मेक ट्वेंटी फाइव टीम्स इन दैट ग्रैंड लीग have a chance at winning the grand league along with that going to australia as well as winning lots of cash prizes so go make 25 teams now so this game will be played at the dy patel stadium where we have seen a certain balance between the bat and the ball currently in my team i'm going with one keeper three batsmen three all rounders and four bowlers lots of interesting options and probably also a must win game for chennai as they have lost four on the trot so let's get to the next section So first up the keeper that I've gone with is Anuj Rawat the man who's been opening for RCB was man of the match for them in the last game played a really good knock in fact we have two other really quality options in Dinesh Karthik and Dhoni but the problem is both of them are batting at four down or five down at a time where they don't get too many balls to play so while they might have real match impact not as much fantasy value yet they become interesting GL choices Apart from that three batters for me in the section Virat Kohli who again just slightly missed out on a 50 in the last game Faf Duplessis who started the tournament well now on a slight low but yet is only going to get better as he gets used to these conditions and the last pick Ruturaj Gaekwad who in the last game finally got into double digits so seem like he got a good start and probably not too late before he's going to convert it into a big one So now we are on to the all-rounders and the bowlers some very interesting choices to make in the section but my first pick like always is going to be Vanindu Hasaranga and he's going to be my captain again I don't think there's too much to delve into here because he's been bowling really really well been getting a regular wickets in fact he's not even got a chance to show his batting prowess yet and when he does you're only going to get more points Apart from that the two all-rounders from Chennai Ravindra Jadeja who batted quite well in the last game bowled decently too didn't get wickets but that's also probably coming sooner than later and Mohin Ali who also got close to a 50 in the last game and he'll be my vice captain for this game as he's batting in the top order too apart from that four bowlers from me Dwayne Bravo from Chennai he's look like their best bowler by a distance and unless they play an Adam Mill or Dwayne Pretorius I don't think you have too much else to consider and the three bowlers from RCB Harshal Patel who's looked in top notch form is yet a top candidate for a GL captaincy choice apart from that Mohammad Siraj who has looked a little bit off color but he is generating that good pace which means that wicket should come anytime soon and the last pick the new man Josh Hazelwood the ex CS Kane who's actually proved his T20 prowess in that team itself he's expected to come back for this game and he's slot straight into my team So two really interesting matchups for us in this game. First one is Ambati Raidu who's been dismissed five times by Harshal Patel with a strike rate of about 110. Other matchup is Jadeja versus Kohli and Jadeja has dismissed him thrice again with a strike rate about 110 to 120. So obviously these two bowlers are able to contain two key batsmen of the opposing teams so they become really important matchups especially for your grand league teams. On to the fan to play challenge section where you can make your team with just two, three, or four players. For me in this game, three picks: Mohin Ali from CSK, Vanindu Hasaranga, and Virat Kohli. All three players in form, so I'm backing them. You two go and make your challenge picks now and win big.